Feel free to check out my tea public after the video and support me on Patreon. Watch till the end of the video for more. Last video, I reviewed Armored Trooper Votoms. Or is it actually Votoms, according to my Twitter poll? Eh, whatever, but Votoms is a series that has been highly acclaimed as one of the greatest mecha anime ever made, if not THE greatest mecha anime ever made. I also touched on the show's numerous side stories that are set in the same universe as Votoms. One of these stories is a 1988 OVA series, Armor Hunter Mellowlink, set at the end of the 100 Years War that has torn the galaxy. The story is written by Ryosuke Takahashi once again, with Yasushi Hirono providing the screenplay. But this time, Takeyuki Kanda takes the reins as director. Kanda being best known for his work on The Ultraman, aka Ultraman Jonius, Vifom, The 8th MS Team, and even Dugram with Takahashi himself. And once again, Hiroki Inui comes back for the score. The story of Armor Hunter Mellowlink revolves around our protagonist, uh, Mellowlink, who is involved in a conspiracy where him and his squad were unknowingly sent to their deaths as part of an operation, and is then framed for committing the act. However, with Mellowlink as the sole survivor and desperate to prove his innocence, he vows vengeance upon the corrupt authority responsible. As the series goes on, one by one, Mellowlink takes on each of the government officials who partook in this conspiracy, which includes some very interesting and well thought out action scenes. Much like Vodums, the show keeps the tradition of making the robot battles entertaining and unique, except here, Mellowlink is entirely on foot, and takes on armor troopers with only his massive rifle and his wit. Whereas Kiriko is a more stoic, quick-witted, badass protagonist, Mellowlink follows a similar vein, but he's more strategic, as we see him salvage AT ammunition for his rifle and set up traps for his opponents. And while the soundtrack is different from Vodum's, there is still that emphasis on delivering aspects of the action, drama, and tension that occurs within all this, and it's just as effective. And, of course, I've got to talk about the Armor Troopers. As you would imagine, they're all pretty much the same as the ones in Vodums, but with the exception of a few several. And wow, I never thought the ATs would be just as cool as they were in Vodums, even if most of them are simple recolors with a few alterations. But goddamn, I think the Silver Fox is so cool. Also, there is a train with a scope dog head at the front of it and cannons on both sides. Overall, Armor Hunter Mellowlink is a blast. And it also makes for a really nice standalone. No need to watch Vodums to understand what's going on, really. You can just pop it in and simply... get it. Now, for ages, there has been an ongoing rumor that the original masters for this anime have been destroyed, which explains why the only way to watch Mellowlink is on VHS and YouTube. However, it was recently announced that Sunrise will be releasing an entire Blu-ray set for Armored Trooper Vodums, which includes every anime the series has spawned, even Mellowlink. And judging by the screenshots on the promo images, it appears that the show has been remastered into HD. Looks like there's a good chance the show will get a stateside release on Blu-ray. Well, here's hoping. Armor Hunter Mellowlink. It's fun, it's insane, it's entertaining, it has robots. What more do you want? But anyway, if you like what you see, then definitely consider supporting me on Patreon, where for a single dollar, your name can appear at the end of every future upload. Other than that, you can also get early access to videos, exclusive content, commission video requests, and receive a t-shirt of your choice from IT Public. And once I reach enough patrons, I'll review The H-Man, The Secret of the Intelligent, and The Human Vapor. So if that's something you'd like to see, then go support me on Patreon. Feel free to like, share, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff, and this is Titan Goji, signing off.